Yeshayahu 61. The Spirit of the Lord Yahweh is upon me, because Yahweh hath anointed me to preach good tidings to the meek. He hath sent me to bind up the brokenhearted, to proclaim freedom to the captives, and the opening of the prison to them that are bound, to proclaim the year of Yahweh's favor, and the day of vengeance of our God, to comfort all that mourn, to appoint to them that mourn in Theon, to give to them a garland for ashes, the oil of joy for mourning, the garment of praise for the spirit of heaviness, that they be called trees of righteousness, the planting of Yahweh, that he may be glorified. And they shall build the old wastes, they shall raise up the former desolations, and they shall repair the waste cities, the desolations of many generations. And strangers shall stand and feed your flocks, and foreigners shall be your plowmen and your vine dressers. But ye shall be named the priests of Yahweh. Men shall come, men shall call you the servants of our God. Ye shall eat the wealth of the nations, and in their glory shall ye boast yourselves. Instead of your shame, ye shall have double, and instead of dishonor, they shall rejoice in their portion. Therefore in their land they shall possess double, everlasting joy shall be to them. For I, Yahweh, love justice, I hate robbery with iniquity, and I will give them their recompense in truth. And I will be, and I will make an everlasting covenant with them, and their seed shall be known among the nations, and their offspring among the peoples. All that see them shall acknowledge them, that they are the seed which Yahweh hath blessed. I will greatly rejoice in Yahweh. My soul shall be joyful in my God. For he hath clothed me with the garments of salvation. He hath covered me with the robe of righteousness. As a bridegroom decketh himself with a garland, and as a bride adorneth herself with her jewels. For as the earth bringeth forth its bud, and as the garden causeth the things that are sown in it to spring forth, so the Lord Yahweh will cause righteousness and praise to spring forth before all the nations.